Every time I sat down to edit, I felt paralyzed. Too many tasks, too little time, zero energy left for creativity. All I wanted was to move faster, to feel confident in my decisions and actually enjoy the process again. But I kept getting stuck, second guessing every decision, every edit, buried under a mountain of footage and burning out before I ever finished the story. Then I discovered a few AI tools that didn't just help me speed up my workflow, but they eliminated the noise. They sharpened my vision and they gave me back my creative flow. And now I'm working faster with more clarity than ever before. And today I wanna to share with you the exact tools that I use to help me edit faster and eliminate that decision fatigue. And the number one time consuming part of the editing process, at least from my own perspective, is finding the perfect song. And that's why I honestly love Musicbed and their intuitive AI tools. Now, I've been using Musicbed for like 10 years at this point, and for good reason. Their library of artists is just top tier. It's unlike anything out there and it's really helped take my films to the next level. And no, I'm not just saying that because they happen to be a sponsor of the channel, but because I'm an active user of their platform. Their search by song AI and finding similar songs tool is honestly a game changer and it saved me time after time. You simply just type in a popular song that you want to find the exact same feeling for that's licensable and Musicbed spits out a long list of songs to choose from. And the best part, let's say you find a song that you love. Maybe you've used this song before in a wedding film and you want the same vibe. You can search for that song on Musicbed, click similar songs underneath and Musicbed will again spit out a long long list of songs that have the same vibe and feeling. So if you're stuck using the same songs over and over, this is gonna help you switch things up. And if you don't have a Musicbed subscription right now, but you wanna try them out, I do have a 14 day free trial that you can find down below. The next AI tool that helps me edit faster is Plotline. This is a brand new audio transcription slash story editor tool for wedding videographers. And I've made a couple videos about this tool on the platform already, but it is honestly just that good. Plotline helps me build the framework for my films without having to question what my story is. It takes all of my wedding day audio, analyzes the most impactful and emotional moments, gives you a clear transcript and provides clarity that I need on how to start my film with a clear story and starting point, which is honestly usually the biggest challenge that a lot of us face in the edit is where do we start? What's the story? And Plotline really solves those problems. So if you're interested in learning more about Plotline, checking it out and seeing if it could be a good solution for you and your workflow, I am affiliated and have a 10% off discount that you can find down in the description below. Now, color grading is another tedious part of the creative process. It's honestly one of my most favorite parts of the creative process. However, that is not always shared across the board. Maybe you yourself, don't really find color grading a fun experience and you wish there was a solution that could just speed up this process and spit out a beautiful cinematic color without you spending the hours tinkering and trying to find the exact look you're going for. But that's all changed because Imagine AI has now released their beta version of AI color grading. Now, of course, it's not perfect because no AI tool actually is, but it has really shaken things up for how we look at the creative process, and especially for how video creators might look at color grading their projects. It is currently only available for Premiere Pro users, and here's a look at how it all works. You take your Premiere Pro project file, upload it to Imagine. You can select the color and the LUT that you want for your film, and Imagine processes a new timeline with all of your clips colored and processed. Here's a look at one that it did for me, and honestly, I was pretty impressed with what it was able to do with just my log footage. I didn't have to convert anything, I didn't have to add a conversion LUT, I didn't have to add my LUTs, it did all of the heavy lifting for me. Again, it's not perfect, but no tool is, but I can see this being a super useful tool down the road, especially when it improves and it just gets better and better and faster, especially when you're in a pinch, you need a quick solution from creation to end product and you need a way to just bypass the tedious hours of color grading yourself imagine ai is just one tool that you could consider and if you're interested i will have a link to learn more about imagine ai for video down below now switching gears to audio when it comes to capturing audio on the wedding day things happen recorders die, there's feedback in your recording from the DJ speakers, or there's a ton of background noise, and you need a solution to clean this up. But you're not an audio engineer, you're not a guru when it comes to mastering audio. 
and having a tool that can really do a lot of the heavy lifting for you is just absolutely necessary, especially when you're on a time crunch and you need a quick solution. And that's where Adobe Enhance comes into play. I've been using Adobe Enhance since its release and they've done a lot with this tool. They've also added a background noise parameter where you can adjust the intensity or decrease the intensity on how much background noise is actually removed, which I think is a great feature, gives you so much more customization, so much more flexibility in dialing in the exact tone that you're going for for your final file. And one little trick that I actually love to do with all of my wedding films is once I have all the dialogue and the story laid out, I'll actually export an audio file, throw it in Adobe Enhance, and use that as an extra layer for my final film. It just adds some more dynamics to my audio, makes it feel more whole and complete and more polished. So if you're interested in checking out Adobe Enhance, I will have a link down below as well. And the last is easily one of the most used universally, even outside of the wedding filmmaking world, and that is ChatGPT. Now, what could you use ChatGPT for as a wedding filmmaker? Me personally, I use it for how I edit my wedding films. More specifically though, dialing in the exact story theme. What is my film about? What's the controlling idea? So what I'll do is I'll take all of my audio, I'll throw it in plotline, I'll get my transcript, I'll take that transcript and I'll throw it in ChatGPT and I'll ask ChatGPT to give me the controlling idea of this film. What is the story's theme? In one to two sentences, what is this film about? And this just, again, provides more clarity. It provides a way for me to make decisions intentionally inside the edit so that I am basically honoring the story's theme and I am creating a film with a logical progression. It's a great tool to use for video editors and especially in your business for when you need to just enhance the copy on your website or elevate your brand's packaging and just get some ideas that is just simply escaping you in the moment. You need someone that can just give you a little bit of inspiration. ChatGPT is just that go-to assistant for when you need a little bit of support. But those are the five AI tools that I use to help me edit faster, eliminate decision fatigue, and just actually get stuff done. So I hope you found this video helpful and valuable in some way. If you did, it would mean so much if you consider liking and subscribing. Drop a comment below. Let me know if you're using any of these tools. If there's an AI tool out there that you're using that I didn't mention, I'd love to hear from you either way. So until next time, keep creating and telling beautiful stories. Peace. It's so, it's so perfect.